Hey guys, okay, so don't mind the hair or the face, you know, it's getting on my nerves too. Um, I already tried to record this once, but it didn't work. Okay, so I'm going to show you what I have in my everyday, like, makeup bag kind of thing. Um, it just lays on my desk where I do my makeup all the time, um, every morning, but it doesn't really matter where I lay it. Okay, the first thing is NYX Doll Dye Mascara and Waterproof and this color is Extreme Black so that's the box I think it's kind of cute I got into this last year so it's been almost a year but it's obviously not the same one uh, and the brush just looks like, oh, on. looks like this and it works really nice I'm excited on camera you can never see my eyelashes anyways because they stick straight up. Hey, get up pretty. There is a hair. Okay, here we go. Ow. Okay, so this works really nice. You should try it sometime. Look, can you see them? Yeah. Probably not. Okay, the next thing is the Falsies mascara. It's the ridge original one and this one is in brownish black okay that, that is a good name um yeah uh i tried to get black but apparently it's not black i thought it was black black enough for me okay the next thing is eyeliner waterproof eye not waterproof eyeliner Oh, and this is just the regular one. This one's waterproof. Um, liquid eyeliner. So this is my favorite one. It's the only one I'll use. Like, I had this, um, e.l.f. one, and it didn't work out well. The brush was too thick. Um, and it was like a felt tip brush, and, eh. It was alright, but I, I went back to this one. You can see, the, hold on, I'll show you. The Wet n Wild Mega Liner Liquid Eyeliner, and I'm pretty sure it's like the blackest black you can get. It's in 861 because I don't have the package still. And the little brush, like the bottle, looks like this, and it lasts for quite a long time. It looks like that. It's not. It's like a little brush, like an actual brush brush, not like felt it. It works amazingly and then I have a Bond Bell like, what is this eye uh, definition I don't know but um, this is in soft black okay I just got it at Walmart for like four dollars I was like best time whatever I want to work for you um, then this dirty eyelash curler, and there's like, you can see there's like mascara all over the place, but this is by Revlon, does the job. Um, the next is an eyeshadow primer, and this is Urban Decay, uh, primer potion. And you can see that this purple stuff is like coming off like crap or something, I don't know. I only put it in the little bag all the, all the time. Oh, there. This is the bag. The bag. Um, yeah, this looks really nice. I, I love it. But it was not worth twenty two dollars. I was like, what the frig? Cause like the store that I live in, I live in, uh, the store that I live by, it just got it, and that's like the first place you get it anywhere. And it only came like I don't know. five months ago I think. I've had it a long time. Um, it's not a long time, like five months, but whatever. This was twenty two dollars. I was like, what the shit? Anyways, um the next thing is an eyeshadow by Nicabella Cosmetics. I don't know why why I just turned like British or whatever. And this is in tees and it's such a pretty color. It's like a princessy color. You can probably barely see. Oh my god. I just got that all 
look over. Are you serious? Okay, I'm not moving this. It's a really nice color, and now it's all over my computer. Great. Hey, this is. This is. Yeah, I can see the color. Um, a Maybelline Trio, but I don't know what the color is called. It says classic look, and the number on it is WD144. So, I look like that. I've had this like forever. Um, okay, the next thing lip gloss. This is L'Oreal Paris Color Juice in Berry Burst 220. And it goes on really nice. It's really shiny, and I like the little application thing. Oh, you dropped it. Okay, the next thing I keep in there for all time in case I get like a pimple or something. And I need to get rid of it fast, okay? So this is like my favorite pimple product. I don't know. Um, it's the Oxy Emergency Acne Vanishing Spot Gel. It looks like dust. We got out Walmart. And it comes in like a little pump and it smells delicious. Look at my face. Yeah, that's kind of weird, but whatever. Um, the next thing is Physician Formula Bamboo Wear Powder. It looks like this. Um, this. And it comes with a little mirror and brush set thing. And I have the Kabuki brush there too. Um, the Kabuki is really nice. I'm not so fond on this little brush, but whatever. Okay, the next thing is rice powder. I haven't been using this over the summer because I find it makes me cakey, but it's nice for like, throwing your purse or something. Like if you get oily during the day. The next thing that I use almost daily is Fox and Relax by Hard Candy, and this is in Skinny Dipping. It looks like this. And this actually is not brown, that's pink, but like compared to, hey look, it's pink, but it just makes it look brown by the, the um, really bright pink color in there. This is concealer, it's by Annabelle, it's the Skin Tree Concealer. information on it. I've had this for a really long time, like since last November, and it's still pretty, pretty, uh, cool. Next thing is a blush. I don't know what its name is. Um, according to the back it says plum, but that's from a lip gloss that I had from Elf. Um, it looks like that. It's really rosy pink. It's nice. But, yeah. This is from Claire, by the way. And then I have this NYC Color Wheel Mosaic Face Tattoo. It's just like a bronzer. It's a bit too dark for me. But I can make it work. Like, if you put on a little bit, it shows up. And the next two things are my moisturizers. Um, I don't know what this one is actually called. But, like, they gave me a sample in December, I think. And it's from the body, sh body shop, and it's Aloe Soothing Day Cream, and it looks like this, which is just white. And like this, hold on, this would last you a really, really, really long time, because you only need like not even a fingerprint, like dab it in, you you got your whole face covered. Then this is um, the Youthology. Uh, Radiant or new perfecting gel. And this is the third step in a line of things. I don't know. And I randomly have this eyebrow and eyelash separator because I was plucking my eyebrows this morning. This is just a lot. Why did you explode on my computer? Mm -hmm. Yeah, this usually isn't in there. This is along with my brushes. And my foundation is CoverGirl clean makeup. It works. It works decent. My favorite foundation is the my long photo ready. And I'm in like shell during the winter. 
No. Yeah. No. No. I'm in shelter in the summer, and then like vanilla or something in this in the winter. Yeah, because I get really pale. Anyways, that's it, and I'll talk to you later. Peace out, good guys. I'm gonna go clean like a piano. Bye.